uh, fabric shaver removes fabric pills from your garments. So you're gonna I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors, pay for everything on my plate. Hello my friends, it's Connor and welcome back to another weekly vlog. Before we jump into the video, I want to thank today's weekly vlog's sponsor, which is ShopTagger. I've mentioned them on my channel before in another weekly vlog. If you've never heard of ShopTagger, pretty much what it is, is a Chrome extension that helps you save money when it comes to online shopping, which is pretty much all I ever do. I literally, come to think of it, unless it's like essentials, like everyday stuff, I never buy things in store. I will always get it online. I mean, a global pandemic definitely doesn't help that situation, so I feel like we're all doing a lot of online shopping. ShopTagger helps you to never miss when things go on sale and it can also test a bunch of different coupon codes for that particular website, which is always handy. So you're not having to go under Google and searching up like coupon code for this store and trying to find one that works. ShopTagger just kind of tests them all automatically through its system and then finds one that works, which just saves you the hassle of trying to figure it out yourself. And it'll find you the one that gets you the most money off. So you know you're gonna get the best price possible because we're all bargain hunters here, aren't we? I will have all the info about shop tagger listed in the description box down below as well and stay till the end of the video to find out how you can win a five thousand dollar gift card to any store of your choice on shop tagger particularly since black friday is coming up shop tagger will be super super helpful in finding all the best deals for you so basically what you can do is save items to your dashboard so say for example if something you want is out of stock you can kind of save that item and then you can get a notification from shop tagger letting you know when it's back in stock they also have an app that you can download onto your phones like i mentioned in my previous video talking about shop tagger I've been saving a lot of things for my house so I've been saving things like decor and furniture bits and pieces and particularly since I have quite a few birthdays around now and Christmas is coming up it's like the perfect time to you're right, mate. It's really easy to just save some items if you're thinking about getting them for friends and family. It's a free download, so you just go into the Google Chrome store and install the Shop Tagger extension. And then once it's installed, it's all ready to go. And it has so many different retailers on there. So you're pretty much guaranteed to find a store that you shop at on there. So for example, I have got this coffee table saved from Temple and Webster, and they have just notified me that it's on sale right now, um, which is really, really awesome. That actually would look stunning in my house my empty house that's not even built yet and these plants that I've saved are on sale and it's just super handy to have everything in one place and you can also create lists so if you've got like beauty products fashion home decor whatever you can have it all organized and most of the time when I'm shopping just like randomly I'll get the little like pop-up on the side that says coupons found for this website they've also just launched a new cashback feature so you can earn money when you shop through your PayPal from selected retail partners which is great because especially like now if you're doing Christmas shopping you're actually getting a little bit of money back which is always nice if you guys are interested in checking out shop tagger i will leave them in the description box down below good morning guys welcome back to another weekly vlog i'm at the gym right now it is 6 56 a.m i need to put my hat on i like wake up at 5 30 and yet i still kind of like end up kind of rushing at the end because i just i don't know sometimes i'm silly but it's monday today that last week went so fast my alarm went off and you know when you're like i thought it was the weekend and i was like oh my god it's monday so anyway i'll chat to you guys after yeah Whew, that was a really good session um if you're interested in the calories we did 254 active 303 total calories Alrighty, so i'm gonna wash my hair today and get stuck into some work I wish I had something more exciting on, but I don't. It's the reality of my life. some makeup it's actually 11 47 normally i finish my like usually i get the weekly vlog ready to go about 1 p.m so i'm a bit ahead of schedule today right so i just got in a package from janora which is my marine collagen that i take and they've launched like a new flavor or a new product which i'm very excited for so i'll unbox it hi connor we are super excited for you let me turn off the fan 
We are super excited for you to try our newest limited edition flavors of Renew Plus and can't wait to hear what you think. Oh, my Coke with Genora is Connor 10. Right, I really need to get one of those blow drying hair brushes. Damn it, I should have added, I ordered some stuff off Amazon too this morning. Should have added that to the cart. I haven't had my Genora today yet, so this is good. <gasps> Mango? Oh, hell yeah. Mango, watermelon, and then, oh my God, yes. A bright pink shaker. I've got a purple one of this and my brother takes it all the damn time and puts his dirty protein shakes in it and makes them stink. Cause does anyone else's brother do that? They use all your shakers and then they leave their little protein shake in there and then it gets, it stinks. Yeah. So he will not be touching that one. Mango and watermelon. The packaging is so cute. Ooh, not the strongest scent in the world. Oh, no, 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 I can smell it. <laughs> All right. So, thank you so much to Janora. Janora has definitely made my hair grow so much longer and so much stronger. But yeah, I think I'm, this is so cute. Okay. Where is my brain out? Okay, I'm going to do some filming, editing, content stuff, and I will check in with you. Maybe when I make my lunch. I think I'm going to have my edamame pasta for lunch today. So that'll be very delicious. Okay, so the time is now 4.11. Fran and I are just gonna pop out to the shops. I'm just gonna get a kombucha. Are you gonna get anything? Mames. Uh, I've knocked my ear a few times today. I think it's because of these nails, which I actually quite like them. It's like a really dark purple. Um, however, I've knocked my ear a few times. That's a bit sore. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. And then the weekly vlog's going up in 50 minutes. Okay, just finished up at the gym. Um, and that was a really good session. Right here. Let me end my workout. Hang on. I'm gonna pop into Woolies. Take a guess what I'm gonna get. Pizza bases. <laughs> when they go on sale, I'm gonna buy multiple. Let us skedaddle. My heart's been ripped wide open. So many mixed emotions It's like I finally noticed I've been set free I've been set free I spent a lifetime running Fearing what I'd become if I Stop playing goalie on all of my thoughts yeah. Speaking out straight from my heart but now I see now I see, oh I see this love is taking over, breaking through my chest and overflowing, with every single beat it pulls me closer, closer to you. Alrighty, so the time is now 9.33. I actually totally forgot I have a meeting at 10 a.m. I got in my Amazon package that I ordered yesterday. Amazon Prime. So this is, did I tell you that I ordered anything? I think I told Freya that I ordered some stuff from Amazon. So I'm gonna unbox it for you today. I am always on Amazon, like adding things to my cart, but I hardly ever check out because I'm like, I don't need that. But this time I was like, yeah, you know what? I do need that. Okay, I got a new gel top coat because the one that I use currently is pretty much out. This is the one that I've got. It's like $8. It works fine. This I'm very excited for. I am always in need of a lint roller, but I never have one. Some things I just can't justify buying for some reason. A lint roller is one of them. So this is the Philips, that's in French. Uh, removes fabric pills from your garments. And I've heard that this is like life changing and it comes with batteries. <gasps> we'll have to give this a go. So that's what it looks like. Looks a bit freaky. And I'm pretty sure this works on like couches and stuff as well. It was like $19 too, so it was pretty cheap. Fabric shaver removes fabric pills from your garments. So good that it, it almost feels like air. Interesting. I want to test this out. And then it has instructions. Do I need the instructions? I feel like it's pretty self-explanatory. Surely. That is a thick book. I got some hair clips. Well, I could have actually used those. Just like, these are like duckbill. I think they're called duckbill. Hair clips that don't leave a kink in your hair. I'm not sure if these are going to be any good. So that's what those look like. <gasps> Yay. Okay. I'm going to test out this lint thing because I'm excited. So I got my like lint roller thing. Yeah, I ordered this yesterday and it's already, it came this morning. 
It's working! Stop! This is... Oh my god. Wow! That works so well! It was $19 from Amazon. I'm gonna test it out on my jumper. This is like a jumper from Pretty Little Thing, covered in lint. It's like stained. The camera's like picking up that it's got an oil stain. Oh my god, it's working. I also want to do it on a pair of like Lululemon leggings that I've had ages because they tend to pill. It's like pilling. Look at that. Stop. Oh my god, I'm going to do the other side. Oh my god, that is like brand new. Let me know if they ever email you directly. It'll be probably November, December, but I'm just waiting to get a brief and stuff. I'm sure it's yeah. fine. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. All right, yeah, I'll just make sure I do yeah. that today. Should be in November? That yeah, that thing. should be fine. Look at my yeah. calendar. It's just... Oh my god. Wow. That's crazy. Okay, so I've had my meeting with my manager, um, but I'm just currently in the process of trying to get a photo for a giveaway that I'm doing on my Instagram. So make sure you're following me. I think by the time you see my weekly vlog, will the giveaway, the giveaway will be live. So go over to my Instagram, check it out because this is everything. I'm trying to set it up and make it all look all cute. So there'll be two winners for a friend and then their best mate. So we've got Beauty Fridge. It's with Luna Body, by the way, which is a skincare brand. A mermaid wand, some Bali Body, some Foreo. So I'm gonna sit right there <laughs> and I'm trying to get the little pick. It's actually a lot harder than you think. I've put little like things underneath the products so I can like stand them up. So it looks real cute. Here we go. <gasps> okay, so it's one o'clock. I got my giveaway post, which I'm happy about. I'm feeling very productive at the moment, which is probably one of my favorite feelings. So I just got some stories in the kitchen and some photos. I'm gonna have my lunch now. I'm gonna make pizza and I'm just been listening to Ariana's new album. It's on the fridge. <laughs> this top is a little bit see-through, but I've got nipple covers on, so I don't know if you can see anything. Anyway, this is gonna keep me really, really full until dinner, probably. Got face. Happy Wednesday. I keep thinking of being unproductive today, but I don't know, I need to stop thinking that I need to do a million and one things every single day. And that means I'm being productive because it's not healthy. Being productive looks different every single day. I feel like I need to remind myself that. And I'm like, no, Connor, you have been productive. I filmed a reel, I've done some editing. Um, I cleaned my makeup brushes. I got a picture and I sent it away for a 
approval. Like I've been productive. But yeah, basically I did all that today. I did some cleaning this morning as you guys would have seen. I didn't go to the gym this morning. I woke up at like 5.30. I was just kind of like, oh, I'll just like kind of snooze my alarm. And then I woke up again and it was about 6. 36 and I was like I have to have to get up now and get going to, if I want to go to the gym or just skip it today And I was like, oh, I'll probably just skip it because I feel like I just needed a rest I might go for a walk this afternoon. We'll see. I haven't been going on walks actually It's really weird because I've been really into them, but I haven't been lately I've just been filming the sponsored part of this video that you guys would have already seen. It's 1.28 p.m. I'm just going to continue doing some editing. My skin's been pretty bad. I've got makeup on. I did like a face mask this morning. I think I'm going to go book in for a facial somewhere just to see. I don't know. I think it's hormonal. I haven't been having OxyShred. Like I said in my previous video, it could be whey protein. So I think I've heard a few people say that. So I might need to stop having it. But I love it so much. Oh, like I might get a, a pea protein or a vegan protein. We'll see. I used to always have the prana protein. I might get that from Elite Sups. We shall see. Yeah, not that much exciting stuff happening. Yeah, I will check in when I do something more exciting because this is not exciting. Good morning, guys. Happy Thursday. Sorry, I have. I feel like my vlogs have been so boring lately. I don't know. I'm at the gym today. I don't have much on today, really. I swear, my weeks are either really, like, exciting, like, I have a lot to do, or, like, a lot on in terms of, like, appointments or going somewhere, and then I have other weeks where it's literally just me every day working at the computer. So, you know, it's just the luck of the draw. After I go to the gym, I'm going to get some coffee beans from Zarafas, and I'll chat to you after. Hey guys, please excuse my appearance. It is currently 10.52, I've just been editing, and I was like, you know what I'm gonna do for this week's, like, for some quality content? I'm gonna compare my height to people. I was doing this last night with Freya and her boyfriend and oh my god it was so funny. Um, and I've kind of seen like those TikToks where people compare their heights to like famous people and it's so funny. So that's what we're gonna do. I've got a tape measure here. Is this this content that you signed up for? Probably not but here we go. Let's just see. I'm five feet tall. Freya and I were like measuring ourselves. It was weird because when we imagined me lying down it said it was like five foot two but then lying, standing up I was like right on the dot five foot. I don't know. Freya's about five foot one or I think yeah we're pretty much the same height which is it's always nice when you're, same, when you're the same height as your best friend I mean you could just pick random heights let me do Miley Cyrus so according I'm gonna be using IMDB so who knows if this is like accurate accurate she's only five foot five why did I think she was she seems like a very tall human being right so okay so two feet three feet four feet five oh gosh okay so, how am I gonna do this? See, this is not, I need to like angle you down. This is not the right angle. Oh, that's fine, surely. That's five foot five. So, that is, <laughs> okay. Wow, okay, because five foot five sounds, that's like average, hey? So this is me next to Miley Cyrus, in case any of you ever wanted to know that. Whenever people meet me, which by the way, side note, if you ever see me in public, please say hello. I get so many DMs from people saying, I saw you here, but I didn't want to bother you, so I didn't say hi. Please say hi. I probably have resting bitch face, to be honest. I'm just probably in my own little world. Even if I've got my bloody AirPods in, which I tend to do, still interrupt me, say hello. I'm, I promise I don't bite. Like, I promise, please say hi to me. I love meeting you guys. If you're five foot five, this is what you look like standing next to me. I think when people meet me, they're like, oh my god, you're actually a midget. That's Miley Cyrus. Let's do another one. Wait, let me do Timothy Chalamet. Is that how you say his name? Right, so according to IMDb, he's five foot ten. So, for all my lads who are five foot ten, which I feel like that's a very average height, hey? Five foot ten is about there. Wow, that's. Very tall, hey. Like I said, I feel like this is not the best angle. <laughs> That's tall. Wow, okay. This is giving me a whole new perspective on height. All right, let's do. <laughs> I'm just sending Snapchats to my friends like what? I have friends who are 5 foot 10 and they look like this next to me. So getting photos on a night out is near impossible. All right, let's do, who is it? Who's six foot five? Army, what's his name? Uh, uh, the guy, Army Hammer. Let's, he's six foot five. Six foot five. If I'm ever with someone who's like over six foot three, it's just gonna look so funny. Like, is that even in the frame? Me next to someone who'd be six foot five. I'd literally be looking up like this. Do you imagine me? 
with a boyfriend that high? Surely not. <laughs> okay, that is six foot one. Far out, that's still freaking tall. What's his name from after? I am a short mother. Five foot four. I feel like five foot four is a nice height. I hope you enjoyed that segment of me comparing my height to people. <laughs> okay, so it's now about 2.20 p.m. I've just come to Kemp's warehouse just to grab a few pieces. Well, I need to get like cotton pads. That's what I'm doing. See this love is taking over, breaking through my chest and overflowing. With every single beat, it pulls me closer, closer to you. Good morning, guys. It's always 6:56 a.m. whenever I film. I'm at the gym. I was gonna go at 9:15 because I tend to go at 9:15 sometimes when it's a Friday, just because it's. Friday, but I literally woke up naturally at like five just before six and I was like oh I may as well just go at seven so that's what I'm doing but yeah I'm in all stacks today I'm so excited for the new seamless collection to drop I saw Jazz got her package yesterday so I might get mine today and I'm so excited um to see all the colors because I've never tried seamless collection before so yeah, that might come today. Then I think Freya and I are gonna go out for some drinks tonight. We'll see. But I need to go to probably like Aldi and get some almond milk after the gym today. I'm always needing something, like whether it's milk, spinach, or like just something from the um, supermarket. All right, I'll chat to you off. Wow, that was a really good session. My camera is on low battery. Damn it. Holy moly. If you're interested in the calories, 237 active. 281 total. Oh my god. Alright. I've always put my case to fire watch band on the tightest one whenever I do cardio because it slips around otherwise. I'm gonna take off my sports bra. I don't know if this is weird. Because I don't want it to like get my tan off. Does anyone else do this or am I a freak? It's just me. Okay. I'm gonna pop in. It's just slipping around my waist now. I'm gonna pop into Aldi. I think Aldi or Woolworths. Aldi or Woolworths. Oh wait, no, Aldi's not open yet. Okay, we'll I have to go to Woolworths then. Get some almond milk to make my pancakes. It's like that TikTok where it's like, people tell me I'm obsessed with this, but I am obsessed with it and it's okay. Hello guys. Um, I put a jumper on, I know it's weird. I get really cold when I have cold beverages because I'm a freak. We got some packages. So first one, what, where is this from? Zip sticker. I think I've tried these before. Actually could do with some zit stickers to the honest at the moment. Oh no, there she goes. Ooh, zit sticker. This is, what does this say? Press Refresh Hydrogel Exfoliating Sheet Mask. Soothes breakouts, unclogs pores. Like a little bookcase of sheet masks. Thank you, zit sticker. And then, what is this? It's from Frank Body. What? Innuendos that they have in store for me today. A couple of strings attached. Pat yourself on the bum. 2020 is nearly done. 2020 has been naughty. It's time for something nice. <gasps> oh my god! Look at the size of it! So this is their mega size original coffee scrub. I love using this, um, like fade my tan evenly. This works really well because the oils soak into your skin and it's also good for like exfoliating and stuff and it smells amazing. Jumbo size, thank you so much, Frank Body. Those are the packages that I have at the moment. I'm gonna get stuck into doing some editing. I've got a little bit to do and then I will, yeah, check in with you guys. Maybe when I get ready for tonight, I think, cause yeah, Frey and I are gonna go out for some drinks. We'll see. Okay, so the time is now 4.40. I'm about to start getting ready to go out. So I'm gonna do a bit of a time lapse. I've just pinned my like fringe back because I've blow dried it. So I'm probably gonna go for a very like same look that I do every single time. Um, I'm gonna go over my face with some micellar water though, just because I've got sunscreen on.
guys, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. If you guys watch my videos, you know that Stax is one of my favorite activewear brands. Stax and Gymshark are my faves. I just got in the brand new Seamless that is launching on Friday. Friday the 13th at 9 a.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Time, I'm pretty sure. So I thought I would unbox this for you and show you. All the colors have been revealed and everything, so I am very excited. I've never... <laughs> I've never tried um, their seamless. My code with Stacks is just Connor 10 and that will get you 10% off. The colors are incredible. Rose. Oh my God, that's stunning. I wear an extra small in Stacks. Thank you, Don and Matilda. Killed it. They've also come out with some like smaller bike shorts, like a more midi length. Ooh, that's cute. A beautiful orange. I love these colors. They're like perfect for spring and summer. Very like, I would describe that as magenta. Oh, I'm so excited. They feel incredible. Then we've also got a purple. Ooh, so excited. Oh my God, stop. There's matching G-strings. Oh, that's gonna be hella comfy. And then there's also a forest green color. I'll try this on for you guys. So if you are interested in shopping, you can see what it looks like. I'm a sucker for green because I have green eyes and it always makes my eyes look greener. Okay, I'm gonna do some try-ons for you guys. I don't know what color to put on. I hope this lighting's all right. Okay, this is the orange color. How stunning. So this is the strappy crop. I love that the adjustable part is at the front. So that is what it looks like. I took out the padding just because I feel like I don't personally need it, but they do have padding if you do like that. It's got like ribbing here. I've got a really short torso. So as you can see, it kind of like joins. I don't know if it's overexposed. Okay, I think that's a bit better. So that's what the crop looks like. So it just got the little Stax logo. It's just so smooth. It feels very different to the like best black fabric, um, obviously, because it's seamless. So comfy, but very like compressive but in a comfy way. Like it's not uncomfortable at all. So I'd say if you think you're my size, extra small fits beautifully. Yeah, it is definitely like on the longer side, but keep in mind, I do have a very short torso. So I think if you have a longer torso, you'll probably have more of a gap in between the top and bottom if you are wearing them as a set. Um, so that's what the bottom shorts look like. I'm so smooth. They've also got like a little ribbing just underneath the bum. So it's like really flattering. And that is what it looks like on the back. Wow, these make your bum look fantastic. <laughs> I'm literally out of breath. These are stunning. These are the full length tights. This part here really like sucks you in, holds everything down. And obviously on me that still overlaps, which I kind of love though, but I feel like these are just so, oop, that exposure, come on. These are so flattering. Dude, I'm obsessed and so smooth. I think this is definitely my favorite fabric from them. I feel like I like this even more than the best black tights. Like it's that nice. Okay, I'll try on the other orange um, top. That's what this one looks like. And they have, just so you can see, the padding is like the same color, but um, I just take that out. This is such a wearable green, I feel like. Same thing, so comfy. Wow, I'm, I'm so obsessed. So in regards to how supportive the crops are, they're actually pretty darn supportive. I would 100% do weights in just the tops alone. If it was like a hit cardio day, um, I'd probably want to wear like a more supportive sports bra underneath for weights, 100%. 
so supportive. Like they're very, like I said, compressive. So um, like I probably would even be a right for hit because I do have fake boobs, but I imagine I would want to wear a sports bra underneath for hit days. But that's just for reference in regards to the supportive nature. Cause they're not a sports bra. Like it's a tank. I don't know, but I mean, it really just depends what you're comfortable with, but. That is hands down the best collection from Saks I've ever tried. Wow, 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 wow. If you've never tried, like, I'm blown away. I'm also gonna have a little haul on my Instagram, so that'll be saved as a highlight if you wanna, like, check it out again. So make sure you follow me on Instagram as well. But that, I hope you enjoy that little haul because I know so many of you guys love Saks. So very, very excited for the launch on Friday. The sizing is honestly perfect for me. The black shorts don't dig in at all. Like, extra small is perfect. So if you think, you know, you're similar to me. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy it. Okay. Okay, so that is the end of today's weekly vlog. Me again from the future or like from the past. Thank you so much to ShopTagger again for sponsoring the beginning of this weekly vlog. For those of you who have it stayed till the end, ShopTagger are actually having a $5,000 giveaway, which all the info for that will be in the description box, of course. I don't know what store I would use that on. Actually, no, I would definitely use it on something like a Dares or some sort of homeware shop. Yes. 100% because that would be so handy. If you happen to be the lucky winner of this competition, you'll be emailed by ShopTag on the 25th of November and you can choose a $5,000 gift card for any store of your choice. Crazy. So I would definitely recommend entering if you are interested. But that is it for this weekly vlog. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did end. As always, I hope you're having a lovely day or night wherever you are in the world and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.